Hello everyone and welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. I'm Ran Giacomo and Doc is here to watch me suffer as usual. Hello. And today we are gonna try and Last time Ran had a volun involuntary reaction to the ice worm. You mean a panic attack, yes, maybe. Anyway, um, today we decided we are missing some really crucial stuff like, oh, you know, the bronze scrappling arm. So I'm going to try and go get those now, and every time I guess this tip I get terrified. But I think this was the right area where we got that. Hopefully. Maybe. Ow. Have I already opened that? Yes, I have. I forgot just how deep this could go. At least we can actually get the Seedrock in here now. Ow. Oh yeah. I forgot those things were down there. Say so. You know that these things are programmed so that if they attack you, they they're programmed. The only thing that's programmed to attack you multiple times in a row is the ice worm. Still, the ice worm gives you a break in between. Yeah. You can outrun the ice worm. I haven't built a thumper once. You know how I said we didn't really need a scanner room? And I wish we had one. Because I think you can scan for blueprints, right? Yes. It can. Might be useful. Would be kind of difficult to build a base down here, though. But maybe, like, higher up? Oh no. Remember who told you that you would probably need a scanner room? Yeah, good point. I hope they have good range. It's decent. Oh, I actually went far deeper than the... <laughs> Architect Sanctuary. And I'm not even sure it was in the right location anyway. Like... The wiki only say to go to the Lily Pad Islands, which doesn't exactly help because I don't remember having been to the Lily Pad Islands. They're supposedly near this biome. Am I? Oh, over there. Okay. Um, might 
be this way? Like for all I complain, I would actually kinda like to see the Lilypad Islands, they, they look kinda cool. Don't no matter how much I say that, I'm still freaking terrified. Oh, that looks like a scannable. That's just a Citrox fragment. Nope. So there's the vents. This... I think I've been here before. Either way, it's not some... Nothing I don't already have. Um... Hmm... This might be the right direction. Hopefully. Still having trouble figuring if I'm even going in the right direction. Is that just Delta Base? Yeah, that's Delta Base. Should I be close to Delta Base? Oh yeah, I forgot I can just remove the Tomper from the list. I already crafted one and I might not even need it, I don't know. If nothing else, it might be useful for getting the the four from those things, but yeah, this is probably not the right direction, but Dog, how lost am I? Yes is a valid answer to that question. Got it. Oh, hit that. I don't oh, right. actually really know. Because I'm gonna be honest, you know my sense of direction. Welp, Sidra cannot get in there. So either I keep going towards one of those, or I try going in. Fuck it, what could possibly go wrong? Don't answer that, okay? Ruby. I forgot to sort my inventory. are closed, that's kind of pointless, that's also closed, probably. Only way is down I guess. 
At least I have quite a bit of oxygen this time, but yeah, I think I've been down here before. So that's probably maybe a good sign. Hydrothermal spire, yeah. Okay, let's go. Well, that's one thing I didn't already have. Might be useful sometime. Okay, that was kinda useless. Oh well. Too late for that one, but how am I doing on oxygen? I should probably go get this thing. Oh, right. Uh, that's the wrong one. Uh, five. Oh, three powers, sir. Kind of already scanned that. Did I really just leave an entire data? Oh, come on. That's just insulting. Also, where's the oxygen? Where's the oxygen? Oh, that thing recovered. Doesn't give me much, but... I do not need a Builder Fragment. Seconds of oxygen remaining. Yes, yes, I would like to find some plants to There's some. Uh... <laughs> I don't think there's actually much else here. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. It's gonna give me that warning a lot on the way back, isn't it? I see you found the assembly yard for prawn suits. Yeah, we've been here before, but... I did find a couple things we had missed last time. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get that warning a lot. Seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay, yeah, enough. <sighs> well, um, what did we get out of all that? Brown suit, jump jet upgrade. That's probably useful, right? And we got the thermal plant. And 
and I think that's it. No sign of the... Uh, what's the word? Grappling hook. And you're like, this is supposed to be split by biomes. Uh, I have no idea what they mean. There's that cave over there as well. That I can't really get into. I guess I can follow this direction. And maybe this way. Well, um, I guess that's maybe sort of the right way. Don't ask me how the hell I'm going to make it back afterwards, but... Oh, hey! It's the... Uh, this other biome that was mentioned. So, this biome should be connected to the lily pad. Biome, but... That doesn't exactly help. Ooh, what's that? That's pretty. What is that? Uh, dog, do you have anything to say about whatever that is? Harmless. Hmm? Huh? It's a giant eyeball jellyfish. But like... Really? Scan wow. it! Vent garden harvests geothermal energy to the life that grows within. Well, like, it's even got structures inside. Go scan it! No. It's not hostile! I promise. Uh, maybe later. And I want to get to the... You know, the body. Rising temperatures detected in mineral rich fissure below. Oh boy. That looks like a thing I could possibly scan. Thermal plant! Of course, not that I got it, it's freaking everywhere. Oh boy, more ruby. Don't think I need more ruby right now. That could be useful too. that I guess it could have something useful. Either way, let's first, you know, store some some stuff up. No idea what that's supposed to be. meters below sea level. Chunks of the sea base sank around me. One hand gripped the monster's scales. The other was clamped around the shard of metal I'd lodged into her eye socket. Wounded, maybe, but still deadly. I'd already taken out one eye. 
I damn near carved out the other. We were headed for the void at the crater's edge. Blinded, she was spiraling deeper. I had a choice. Hold on, or let go. I clung for dear life as she took us deeper. I had one minute of air in the tank. Back then, I could go another three with what I had in my lungs. So I had four minutes to kill the Reaper. Minus a few to get back to the surface. Hmm. It ain't that I like killing folk. It's just sometimes what you need is on the inside of someone else's rib cage. I killed that beautiful, terrifying creature, and I made for the surface. When I caught my breath, I realized we'd come further than I thought. I was surrounded by watery void, just me and ocean. Nothing else. Well then, interesting, interesting story. What do you think about that? Pretty fun. We also found this. No, pro no oh. problem with handling no problem. that with my bare hands, right? No problems. I should probably grab more of that if I happen to see. Uh, now, where is... Oh yeah, I can disable that thing now, can't I? Okay, so it's, it's fine. You there. can handle active uranium with your bare hands. Well, yeah. more thermal plant what do you want to bet is more thermal plant it's more thermal plant okay so body catchy is that away still a good distance I should probably Out here, um, let me guess. Freaking thermal plant. At this point, I'm just scanning them so they don't light up anymore. <laughs> okay, so... Body Cache is that way. That's a base over there. Kind of. Oh, that's her base, isn't it? Yeah. Welcome, you found Scary Lady's home. I think you can go different places in her house now. Because I think she's back. Yeah, probably. You again. Hmm. Sop. Sop, bitch. Can I scan her? No. <laughs> no, not again. You already scanned her, remember? I did. Huh. I scanned yeah, him. Yeah, you can go into... I think you can go into this left room now. You scanned her at the other place. Oh, right. At the greenhouse. Oh. Could use a shower.
How long have we been going without pooping? You can also toilet and sink. The place is kind of a mess. Oh, by the way, if you had come back here uh, before the uh, thing, at least when I last did this, the dog would be invisible, like the, Fortnite the dog indoor voyage. thing. I was more or less living inside. Would be invisible, but still guarding the door shelter. to this back area. Huh. The flesh was starting to rot. The stench was unlike anything I'd ever smell. As we floated, the temperature dropped, and the rotten meat began to stiffen and freeze. Slowly, almost imperceptibly, the Reaper began to lose buoyancy. We sank a little each day. My sanctuary was becoming my tomb. I was at the mercy of the current and the winds. Until one day, I saw a smattering of penguins in the distance. Swimming birds usually mean solid land of some kind. I was lucky. The winds followed their path. Hours later, I saw a blessed sight. An unmoving cloud sitting upon the water. Land. It renewed my spirit as I watched the land get closer and closer. The reaper slowly sank, but I was no longer worried. When the Reaper finally sank below the water, I was close enough to lazily swim my way to shore. I made a note to come back for the Reaper skull. I didn't ride the beast for three weeks to have no proof. <laughs> Land never felt so good, even in this Arctic hell. She's pretty interesting, eh? By yeah. the way, you're thirsty and hungry. Oh, so I am. And now I'm not. Vital signs stabilizing. You never even warned me about my vital signs then. Freaking AI. You know what else I should probably do? Make sure that my Citroc is well repaired. How much I bump against everything? Yeah, like that. Uh, okay, this seems to be the right way down, I think. Maybe. Hopefully. Been here before, haven't we? Yup. We have definitely been here. Huh. How far are we actually from that? Not too far, but not close enough that I. Yeah, this might actually just be the wrong cave again. So as you can see, even with a map, we still get lost down here. Monkeys. 
Sí, te dices su aire, pero ahorita sí, creo. Yes, Adam, that's what I was here for. But even is that? Let's pick, let's pick us some more radiation, shall we? I'm just going to immediately deposit that. And actually, not you, not you, not you. Right, so should be nearby. I am probably way out of my depth and looking in all of the wrong directions because it's directly underneath me. Got it. So now all I can do is look around. Oh, what are you? Is that thing dangerous? Doesn't seem like it. That's kinda terrifying. That's actually probably useful. See, I do go and scan living things sometimes. Which one the way down? Uh, yeah, because it's like... Straight down pretty much. Can I want? Yep, loop plant. Um, okay, don't think I can actually do anything with that. Structure, so it must be this way. Probably. You think this dog? Only a bit. Yeah, I kind of wish you would help a bit with the commentary instead of playing Stellaris, I'm guessing. But you know. I am helping where I can, but. I don't want to throw spoilers at you. Yeah, but you know, you can comment on what we see and... I don't know, answer, I guess. But hey then, we made it to this place. Hey, your first bot, your first corpse. You know, for a moment that I almost thought you said your first boss. Was like I don't think this is that kind of game. Is it? You have a 
You haven't scanned nickel ore. I haven't? No, you have not. Oh. I saw the scanner button. Whoops. Well, this is... Definitely a thing. Uh, I should probably not walk in there. Well, that's something. We finally made some actual progress! Yay! Um, you know, we, we have the thermal plant. We didn't get any of the things we actually set out to get. But hey, you know, we, we have uh, uh, this thing. Yeah, the architect's skeleton. Yeah, and now you just need their tissues and their organs. Yeah, you know, yeah, there's, uh, we can make a shower. That's important, right? Yeah. And I guess Baby. the thermal plant. And I kinda really wish we had gotten some of the things we actually wanted, but oh well. Too late to be worried about that. It's been a long episode and maybe we'll find it next time. It's uh I have no idea in which volume we even are. Probably doesn't even matter. Either way, hope you'll have fun and... Probably click on that little biomes thing to tell you what biome you're in. That's just to change that, which doesn't actually tell me anything. <laughs> it changes the color, that's it. Anyway, hope you'll have fun and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.